This Roblox game can kill you if you play it. I'm not kidding. It's extremely harmful to certain people. And games like this in the past have resulted in death. Roblox comes with some safety concerns. So naturally, I'm gonna play it. Yeah, I've gathered a lot of Roblox games that could be harmful, and I'm playing every single one. Will I survive? I hope so. Starting off with this game that's literally called Dangerous Game. I don't know what you need to see besides that. This game contains flashing lights and loud audio. If you have photosensitive epilepsy, there's a timestamp on the screen that you can skip to. Now, let's try it out, because apparently in this video, I have a death wish. Watch till the end so you can see me step in front of a moving train. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh my god. That's actually dangerous. Why is this up on Roblox? The point of this is to just put people at risk. I guess they warn you at least. It's like how cigarette companies put warnings on their packages. But let's move on to something different. Look at this article. Team detained after playing on terrorist organizations themed Roblox servers. I don't need to explain why terrorism is dangerous. I mean, people could die from this. But hey, let's try and play some games. Huh, it's shockingly difficult to look up this type of game on Roblox. The closest I could find was Terrorist Pack for the Netherlands. And this has been taken down too. I cannot play test this game. I'm sorry. But maybe I can play test the next one. Condo Games. I'm sure all of you know about these. Little Billy tries to join a Roblox game and oh, he's naked. Uh oh. Yeah, Condo Games are a hub for lots of dangerous stuff on Roblox and I'm gonna test them. Wow, I joined a Discord server with 53,000 thousand people. Oh, hey, we found the terrorism tycoon game. That's not suspicious. It's insane that there is a whole community, 50,000 people for this. Oh, time to play test it. Oh, ass? Ass, you say? Well, I gotta see this. I'll go with large. Oh. <laughs> Let me turn around. Okay, I need to censor that. I'm leaving that game. I don't want to be there anymore. I got my large ass. I'm leaving. I play tested it. Moving on to the next dangerous game. One of the few harmful things about Roblox that a lot of people talk about is meeting up in real life with other people. And I'm going to explore a place where they meet by joining this Roblox dating server. I hate this. I hate that I'm doing this. This server contains NSFW and 16 plus content. Proceed with caution. Why 16? 16 plus. That's still a minor. One message into this and I'm being told about the c meter. This is what I just said, by the way, on screen, YouTube. DMs are open for girls. We can date. I look pretty mid, but hey, your choice. <laughs> I'm looking for a sugar baby to spoil with Robux gift cards. I guarantee this man is 85 years old. This is so dangerous. This is a danger waiting to happen. I don't know what you can do, Roblox, but please take take down servers like this. That's a serious actual issue. I, I know I've been joking about it, but that is a, that is real. Moving on to the next dangerous Roblox game. This Roblox game can kill you. A YouTube short by Lemmy the Kid. Credits to him for the excellent idea. Not credits to him for this piece of garbage video. This Roblox game can kill you. And here is why. Although subscribe and like if you want good luck forever. Oh, I guess I gotta subscribe and like. I, I do want good luck forever. This Roblox game is known as natural disaster survival. Yeah, he's stupid. Obviously, this guy's being ironic. He's not actually stupid. He doesn't actually think natural disaster survival is gonna kill you. But because of the purpose of the video, I guess I have to play test natural disaster survival. Will I die? Will I die? This is fine. Next game. But before I talk about it, subscribe. I like to ask you at the middle of the video because by now you know if you want to subscribe or not. And you are not allowed to subscribe unless you're enjoying the video. Only people enjoying the video are allowed to subscribe and I mean it. Check out this YouTube video that I found. There's a very public organization in the US that frequently commits hate crimes against certain groups of individuals. They're on Roblox now, apparently. Look at this video. I don't know what I have to censor about this video. I don't know what not to, but he conveniently left Left a nice Discord link for us to test this out. This game that could actually seriously motivate people to cause harm to others, to even kill them, which is something this organization is known for doing. Invalid invite. Wow. Well, I guess Discord took it down. Why would they ever do that? <laughs> Come on. Well, that's a nice breath of good news during this video where I'm basically trying to die. I'm not dead yet. So moving on to the next game that could kill me. Oh, this is a really popular YouTube short by Vuck 
Vux Vux, who's saying this computer can kill you. This family had problems with their son always annoying the parents. Parents tried ignoring the kid and putting him in the basement. What? Putting him in the basement because he's annoying. They would buy a computer for the kid to play games on so they could live in peace. Let me guess, the computer kills him. The parents asked what he wanted, and he said the child's soul. I appreciate the vine boom to help really make that moment special. All right, so what? I need to test out selling my soul and see if I die. Okay. Some solid, some solid, some solid, some solid. All right, soul sold. I got this cool coin out of it, though. Apparently, it gives me eternal life. Next game. Let's just test Roblox games that claim to be dangerous. Look, dangerous game. Let's try it out. Oh my god, what? Another one with flashing lights and loud audio? I already tried this and I'm still here. I'm not dead yet. You'll get me one day, Roblox game. Why are there multiple of these games on Roblox? This is a bigger problem than I thought. Not only is there one murder game, there's two murder games. This video was not clickbait. You can literally die playing these. I don't want to get home from school on a Friday night and then pass away at my PC. Next game that could kill me. Meep City, which genuinely used to be one of the biggest dangers to children on Roblox and now has been domesticated into garbage mush. The only part that attracted players about the game was the insane underground community of awful things. And now that it's gone, the players have nothing to do but sit there and think about better times. Because instead of doing those things in secret parties, they just do it in the main lobby now. Yeah, this game is sort of lukewarm now. Why can't can't I see naked women and get preyed on? That was the best part about Meep City. I'm joking. I am joking right now. That was horrible. I made many videos to expose it. Well, I guess this game didn't kill me. Time to move on to the next one that might. So in a past video, I tried this game called Swan Location that's apparently supposed to murder you. I don't know, but I did it wrong. See, I played a recreation of the game, but now I know how to play the real game. I have to go to the hub game and then play it from there. Here's the icon that should teleport me there. Oh, okay, okay, here it is, here it is. I actually got into the game and your goal this game is to find like a black spawn pad and then you step on it and then it murders you and i dude i just want to die already all these games saying they'll kill me none of them are actually killing me oh well am i gonna die I can't close the- I, I cannot close the game. Yeah, that's scary and all. I've already been through this once. I was shocked the last time. Now it's just derivative. All right. Am I dead? Only inside. Next game. I want to die already. Don't play Roblox with Spider-Man. Here is why. Although, subscribe and like if you love your family. Ah, I don't love those schmucks. Let's keep going. Anyway, there was a boy named Peter. First of all, no. Dude, that, that is literally my good friend. His name is Jake. You cannot lie to me. And one day, Peter decided to play Roblox with with Spider-Man. Spider-Man pulled off his mask and he was actually Freddy Fazbear. What do you want me to say, man? I mean... It's all right there. You're learning about it with me. And then he actually picked up Peter and threw him all the way to Jupiter. I mean, that sounds tragic. I mean, that sounds like a serious risk. I don't know what you want me to say. You want me to make fun of that? I mean, sounds real to me. Let's play Roblox with Spider-Man. Oh my God, why is his neck snapped? Oh, it's because he's taking off his mask to reveal Freddy Fazbear. How could I forget about that? Oh no, oh no, he's gonna get me. I wouldn't say that I'm dead or on Jupiter. Next game. Now this is genuinely, legitimately dangerous. Single mom's bank account drained after seven-year-old spends almost $900 on Roblox. $900. That's like three Petsim X plushies. Don't you know? That's the cost of rent. Hopefully the mom's gonna get her money back. I feel for her. But honestly, these games on Roblox are getting genuinely predatory. Petsim X with its new weekly update, Hologram. Maybe you can get a hologram of your father telling you that he loves you, but only if you buy the Dragon Lunch box so that you get instantly bullied at school. Time to play test this. Will I die? Am I gonna spend a thousand dollars on this game? These eggs, man, I need to buy them. Look at that question mark percentage. Doesn't that make you just want it? Oh, look at me. I'm a legend. I'm a legend right now. Wait, hold on. I'm getting a text. My bank account is empty. I have to file for bankruptcy. The bank is coming to repurpose my furniture. All right, well, clearly I'm not dead. Roblox might get in legal trouble. That's right. I said it. Legal trouble. Not because of this. Not because of 
Petsim X, but more than likely because of Dangerous Game. The game we played at the very beginning that could legitimately kill you. Obviously, all of the games I've played in the video could be dangerous. Some of them were jokes, but this is one that could genuinely get you killed. And it still has a 50% like to dislike ratio. I mean, why would they harbor actually harmful games on their website? For this long, too. It's been up for a month. Pardon me. It's been up for a year and a month. Maybe this video can help raise awareness for Roblox. Like it, share it around if you want. But final verdict, am I dead? Yes. Bye!